Hello there. Dr. Yonit Arthur here. And I hear you're having a really tough day today. So this is going to be a bit of an unusual exercise because I have no script or specific agenda today. I'm just here to give you reassurance, support, and maybe some observations and thoughts that have helped other people just like you when they've gone through days like this. And I want you to know first and most importantly that everyone who has ever recovered from neural circuit dizziness, tinnitus, hyperacusis, pain, and other symptoms has had days like this one. I guarantee you, you are not uniquely broken. You are not uniquely flawed. You are not the worst case I've ever seen. Everyone gets to the absolute rock bottom sometimes during the recovery process. Everyone who has ever recovered has been through what you're going through today. And yet, they are no longer there, which means that you too will no longer be there. Now, since you are here today, I want to make sure you know that I have personally talked to thousands, thousands of people going through what you're going through right now. Whether you're in your car, trying to drive, trying to live your life normally, maybe you're at work, maybe you're trying to put on a brave face for your kids, maybe you're at home. Maybe you're in your room. Maybe you're even in your bed. No matter where you are or how bad it feels, you are not alone. I personally know other people who are doing the exact same thing as you are right now, who are feeling the same feelings who are also feeling overwhelmed and fearful and hopeless and lost, they are right here with you. And if it makes sense to you to do this, I invite you to imagine even just one or two of them, maybe someone from a success story or a YouTube comment, or from a Facebook group, someone else who's suffering the way that you are. Just imagine them here with you and know you're not alone. Now, I want to remind you that on days like today, it's going to feel absolutely impossible that this can just be a programming error. Your mind may be going a hundred miles a minute trying to figure out the what ifs, the whys, the I missed something or the doctors missed something. This is just your mind's attempt to cope with the feelings of fear and overwhelm that are underneath. None of those questions are going to solve this for you. Because this, these symptoms, this fear, all of this is a programming issue in your brain. It's a neural circuit problem, meaning your symptoms are 100% real, but they're being caused 
by a misunderstanding, just a mistake in your brain. It's just misunderstanding what sensory information means. It's a data processing problem, an algorithm issue. That's what's causing all of this. This is good news because brains are constantly reprogramming themselves and people just like you have been through the depths that you're going through now and their brains have been able to update their programs so they can lead joyful, normal lives again. People just like you have done that and so can you. Even if there is a hardware problem that originally caused your symptoms, your brain is capable of rewiring out of chronic symptoms. A big part of what keeps symptoms going is fear is that overwhelm, is that frustration and that anger. This doesn't mean you have to stop yourself from having these feelings. In fact, what it means is that on days like today, yes, days like today, when you're having the worst day, when you're feeling the most despair, the most alone, the darkest you've ever felt in your entire life, those are the days of greatest opportunity to change your brain. That's because when the feelings are sky high, when the fear is through the roof, when the sensations feel so strong that you don't think you can make it another minute, on days like today, it's when... If you can change your relationship to any of these things, even by an absolutely tiny amount, it will have a huge oversized impact on how your brain interprets and responds to these sensations and feelings in the future. So it's on days like today When you notice the discomfort is so strong, you're not sure you can tolerate it. When you notice the fear makes you feel like you're going to jump out of your skin. Today, today is your opportunity to see if you can tolerate and allow those big, scary, overwhelming feelings even just 1% more than you were before you turned on this recording. Even a tiny 1% shift in your ability to tolerate and allow those big overwhelming feelings and sensations without fighting them, without trying to avoid them or analyze them or fix them, that will have an oversized, huge impact on your brain's understanding of these sensations. It will kickstart that rewiring process that so many people have successfully used to resolve the exact symptoms that you are dealing with right now. I know that on days like today, The feelings and those sensations really don't feel like an opportunity. And you don't have to like them. You don't have to feel positive. In fact, I encourage you not to try to make yourself feel positive if you don't. Grit, courage, is not about positivity. It's about doing it anyway. It's about knowing that you have the strength to do this. And here's how I know. When you turned on this recording, it is very possible that you were 
tolerating that you were going through the absolute darkest, worst moments of your life. And here we are, 10 minutes later, and you're still here. It may not be comfortable. You may have hated every minute of it, and you're allowed. But you had the grit and the courage to make it through. And that's how I know that you can keep going today. Remember, your job is not to like it. Your job is not to be positive or be happy about it. Your job is to see if you can stop fighting. Allow the discomfort, allow the feelings, even just a little bit more than you did a few minutes ago. Slowly, over time, this is what people just like you have done to shift how their brains respond to sensations. This is how you start that changing your brain process. Deliberately, on days like today, when things feel so, so hard. And as you do this, know that there are other people just like you listening to this, doing this exact same thing, going through the same struggles. Imagine them again for a moment. Imagine them with you. You're doing this together. We're doing this together. They believe in you. Believe in them. I believe in all of you. I don't even have to have faith anymore because I see the evidence before my eyes so much that you are capable, that others are capable of recovering from medically unexplained chronic dizziness and other symptoms. Yes, even when it feels like today. I am so sorry you're having a day like this one today. And I hope that my words have helped. What I can tell you What I can guarantee you is things will change. Whatever you're feeling right now, it will change. You are not stuck like this forever. Thank you for listening and thank you for being here. Thank you for your trust. You've got this. I'm rooting for you. And I can't wait to hear from you as you start to feel better because I know you will.